Hi everyone, I'm Lisa Marie Latino for HIP New Jersey, and today we're talking about throwing the ultimate New Year's Eve party. Joining me here are the ladies of Mix and Mingle, Jessica Silverstein and Brooke Poehler. Welcome ladies. Thank, Thank you. you. So we had this next guest here for Halloween and he was amazing. Carlos Ruiz, Cocktails by C. Tell me a little bit about him. So Carlos is the owner of Cocktails by C and he mix and mingles cocktails all over New Jersey. He's fabulous and we would have him at every event. All right, well, let's check out his New Year's Eve cocktail. Hey everyone, I'm Lisa Marie Latino for HIP New Jersey, and today we're talking about throwing the ultimate New Year's Eve party. Joining me here is Carlos Ruiz from Cocktails by C. So happy to have you back here. Thank you very much. This cocktail is very special because the first time I met my, my wife, I actually made this cocktail for her when she was sitting at the bar. So this cocktail is called Love at First Sip. Oh, yeah. I love that. <laughs> now, we have a little variation on the cocktail today by switching over the tequila to an agave spirit. So usually this cocktail is tequila, some pomegranate juice, lime juice, a little bit of sugar, you shake it up and you top it up with Prosecco or uh, champagne if you like. But for this cocktail, we're gonna be using a spirit called, um, it's Rebel Avila. I feel like it's a good luck cocktail. It is, very, very, yeah. So to start off, again, you always wanna use fresh lime juice. I, I don't like the bottle juice or anything that you could buy at the store. I don't care if it says organic on there. You need fresh, fresh, fresh lime juice. So we're going to put three quarters of an ounce okay. into the shaker. Next, pomegranate juice. Uh, my favorite brand is just Palm. Okay. So we're going to put an ounce of this bad boy. And then a little bit of, a little bit of sugar never hurt, hurt anybody. So we're going to put a half an ounce. There you go. And then we're going to put some Avila Rebel Agave Spirit. So this is not a tequila, just, I just wanna you know, point that out. It's an agave spirit. So we're gonna put an ounce and a half. If I drink this, I'm not gonna be able to stay up for the ball drop. <laughs> you will, you will. <laughs> All right, so now you gotta make sure it tastes okay. It tastes okay. <laughs> Add your ice. And then next, what I like to do is double strain it so you don't have any of the ice particles in there mm -hmm. because if you're adding some Prosecco or anything sparkly, you don't really want it to mess with uh, the mouthfeel. Okay. And then we're gonna open up some bubbles. Now you're not gonna hear the, the big uh, pop or else I'll make a mess. And also you don't wanna waste any, uh, any bubbles. Wow. And that's it and then you don't lose any of the bubbles coming out because if you just pop it, you're gonna lose like about, you know, half of your champagne. Just top it off. And then you finish it off with a nice little grapefruit garnish on top. And there you go, you have love at first sip, so hope you like it. Oh, definitely. Cheers. <laughs> Where can people find out more about you? So please follow me on all my uh, channels, social media channels, at Cocktails by C on Instagram and at Carlos, uh, Cocktails by Carlos Ruiz on Facebook. Thank you so much. Anytime. Cheers to you. Happy Thank you. 2020. Thank you. You as well. Yes. And for everything Garden State, visit us at hipnewjersey.com. For more on this segment, log on to hipnewjersey.com.